it's Bushwalker 53. So um, today I've been geocaching in the hills recently and uh, today there's a multi-cache that takes you to quite an interesting spot and uh, tells you a bit about the history of the town that we're going to go in. And we're going to be doing a bit of other geocaching but I thought I'd just film the multi-cache. So um, I'll see you there. So we're now in the country, uh, in a little town, and uh, in a freshly mown park. And from this sign, I've got a number for every single letter of the alphabet, and we've now figured out where the final coordinates to this geocache are. So, um, yeah, we'll uh, get going. Okay, so uh, this, the final stage for this cache is about 7.4 kilometers away, uh, the coordinates that I'd figured out in the description, it said it was around 7 away, so um, should be within 400 meters. But um, it takes you to an interesting place, so I'll let you see for yourself when we get there. But um, a friend of ours that pretty much introduced us to geocaching, um, this was their first cache that they ever did, and uh, it looks quite interesting, so have a look. Okay, so this cache is a bit interesting, we've um, stuffed around near a military base and uh, got the attention of quite a few people, but we're now driving up into an old cemetery, so um, this is very interesting, there's just this tiny little uh, one-way dirt track just to the right of the main heavily guarded entrance to the military base. Um, so I think park here and um, right. park here and go have a look for the cash. So uh, yeah, let's go. Okay, so this bush here, um, this absolutely huge bush, the GPS appears to be pointing to it. So uh, walk over and have a look. Um, hmm, my coordinates are pointing me. Over to this little tree here. I'm not too sure, but I believe it might be in that bush uh, because it isn't actually completely a massive bush. If you look closely, there's an old church hidden in here. And uh, I've only seen this in photos, but it's actually pretty cool when you see it for yourself. We'll have to figure out a way in there, but I think it might be in there, or nearby, so I guess we'll get looking. Okay, so I found the geocache fairly close to where I'd actually figured out the coordinates to be, and I uh, haven't really done many puzzle or multi-caches, so I'm quite happy with myself for <laughs> figuring the coordinates out, but it was an easy one, so. But here is the geocache, found it under here, and uh, it's meant to have a geocoin in it. Uh, somebody was a bit funny with the logging, so I'm not too sure if they have it or if they've left it in here, but um, guess I'll have to have a look. But um, I'll take you for a little tour of the uh, church, because I haven't really seen it for myself yet, but it's covered in ivy, and uh, unless you're up close here, you can't really see, but... There's a church hidden in here, so here's the front entrance. I'll just bring you around it first. Because that pretty much looks like a bush. And every now and then you can see the occasional window, but uh, it's quite big. Anyway, let's go inside. Nice big arch up here, and uh, appears to be the main hall, and then there's some sort of little room out the back here. Um, but yeah, this is pretty cool.
If it was me, I probably would have hidden the cash in that corner or over there, but I guess that would damage the building if people kept going in there, scrabbling around, lifting around rocks and stones that made up the building, so putting it on the outside is probably the best idea. But, uh, yeah, only a little bit of the plastering remains intact, and then there's broken away to see the, um, yeah, stone underneath. Anyway, that's a awesome, awesome multi cache. <laughs> well, uh, yes, we'll be doing a little bit, a little bit more geocaching in the afternoon, um, but nothing too interesting, just uh, going around from cache to cache, and it will be getting dark quite soon, so it'll make for a boring video. So I thought I'd just film this, um, which is turned out to be quite cool. So anyway, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed the video, please don't forget to like, comment and subscribe, and I'll see you later.